Hi, thanks for your interest in art and feminism. My name is Kira Wisniewski and I have the distinct honor and privilege of being executive director here at Art and Feminism. My pronouns are she and her. In this video, we'll give you a quick introduction to who we are, what we do, and how you can get involved. So where we started. We started as a passion project, a side hustle among four friends who read about the gender gap problem with Wiki and wanted to do something about it. This photo is from that first event at iBeam Art and Technology Center in New York City on February 1st, 2014. Since then, the project really grew exponentially and was no longer sustainable as a side project with folks having full-time jobs. And in May of 2019, became an official 501c3 and hired their first full-time employee in October of 2019. And since then, we've been focused on transitioning a collective to a nonprofit organization that works collectively. But to back it up just a little bit, here's the situation. Less than 10% of Wikipedia's editors identify as cis or trans women, and editors that do identify as women are more likely than men to have their edits reverted. But before we even get to that, cis and trans women, non-binary people, BIPOC communities are also underrepresented in the art world. Some stats from our friends at the National Museum of Women in the Arts, a data analysis of 18 major US art museums found their collections to be 87% male, 85% white. And then in Jansen's basic history of Western art, less than 1% are women of color. Art and feminism builds a community of activists that is committed to closing information gaps related to gender, feminism, and the arts, beginning with Wikipedia. Art and feminism envisions an internet that reflects diverse global histories of art making, where communities who have most often been written out of history feel welcomed and empowered to participate in, in, participate in writing and writing our stories. We believe in the power of the arts. We believe that art is fundamental to flourishing in open societies. We are a community of many feminisms. We believe in their collective power to challenge oppressive structures and create new liberating ones. We create safer and braver spaces that are caring, equitable, pro-Black, queer and trans affirming, intentional about accessibility, and all around anti-oppressive. We find joy in our community, knowing it will sustain us in our work. We commit to knowledge sharing and creation on a global scale, highlighting the voices and stories which are often unheard. We also embrace our own learning and unlearning of knowledge so that we may dream of new ways of being and doing individually and collectively. You may notice that the words underrepresented and marginalized do not appear in the mission, vision, and values, and this is intentional. And although not perfect, We've been trying to move away from that language, recognizing that those terms center whiteness, which all ties into that unlearning part. Since 2014, over 21,000 people at more than 1,600 events around the world have participated in our edit-a-thon in 27 different language, languages, resulting in the creation and improvement of more than 100,000 articles on Wikipedia and its sister projects. From coffee shops and community centers to the largest museums and universities in the world, Art and Feminism leads a do-it-yourself and do-it-with-others campaign across the world. And here's a sampling of just some of our partners from over the years. This year, we're very excited. We are going to be celebrating year 10 of Art and Feminism with the theme of collective action. We want to reflect on how communities have harnessed our collective power to address the knowledge gaps we aim to close in our mission. We want to draw on our experiences to dive deeper into collective participation and action as a strategy for empowerment. And this is where you come in. This is where uh, we'd love for you to join us and we have the resources to help get you started, support you during your event and help you after. A lot of this is made possible by our dedicated team of regional leaders. This team uh, really helps us live out our belief that people in their communities know their communities best. So when you get in touch with us, we'll get you in touch with your regional leader and they can help guide you. 
We also have slide decks, guides, and microfunding all available to help assist you. If you want to learn more, if you have questions, if you just want to chat in an informal setting, we invite you to join us for informational sessions about what is art and feminism on Friday, December 9th at 1500 UTC or Thursday, January 12th at 1900 UTC. If these QR codes don't work, here are some, some bitlies you can maybe try. Uh, registration is also available on our website. We really can't do this work without you. And we hope that you'll join us so we can take the collective action together. Thanks to Wiki NYC for letting us borrow their StreamYard account. And I look forward to being in community with you soon.